Got to get the players going. As I wake up. And I think we're at once they set that timer. This is I'm super excited about this matchup. Uh, we'll talk about everything in a moment. I do have to set up the dice cam again, so please excuse me why I rudely leave. Because the dice cam disconnected. Thanks to Steam. Uno momento. Let's open up betting in the meantime for you guys. There we go. All right, get your bets in. Is it the Republic or is it the Empire taking it today for the top eight? Hope that that doesn't happen again. How are you all doing this morning? I'm gonna try to avoid the sun, just being right in my line of sight here. Let me turn off all of this good stuff as well on our interface. Promote it for Tyler as well. There we go. All right, so on the left here, we have Tyler. Uh, I'm gonna say Giebelhausen. Just call him Tyler. Tyler and I play X Wing a lot together, playing his staple. Three Arc 170s and the Y Wing Republic list. We have Oddball, Wolf, Jag, and Broadside. Oddball has expert handling and Kit Fisto. Wolf has actually he has a different list. You know what? He he changed it. So he it's the same list, but he just changed he's changed a couple upgrades earlier this morning. So I'm gonna just really quickly re-update the list to reflect the new one. There we go. All right. Oddball is Marksmanship, Kit Fisto, and R4P Astronaut. We're coming up on an engagement here real quick. So I try to probably have to close the betting early. And then Wolf has no upgrades. Jag has no upgrades. And Broadside has his staple Ion Cannon Turret and Proton Bombs. So we'll see what kind of role Broadside plays in this game. But he's going up against Goliath here. Darth Vader with Jamming Beam, just because it's free, and two Inquisitors with Foresight. So get your bets in now. It's going to be... I know, it is early, but good morning. And, all right, well, Vader and Wolf are squaring off here. Vader doesn't really care. It's just one ship. It is range two. That's where Vader likes to be. Let's turn on the dice cam here. And for some reason, it hasn't updated yet, so we'll just show you guys. Huh, we've lost connection with our dice cam already. We're doing great so far. What is going on there? OBS, virtual camera. Weird. All right, well, stand by, guys. I'll get that fixed after this first engage. Vader taking one to start it though. Wolf shields down already. So very bloody. And Jag reaches out. Hit crit. No lock because no side arc. Safe. Lots of evades. So trading three shields on Wolf for one shield on Vader somehow feels like a win. <laughs> Primary attack. Range three. I think you go into Vader still. Or you can go into the Inquisitor. Two hits. Oh, he doesn't have a focus? He doesn't have a focus. He thought he did. Okay. Next up. Probably doing Foresight here. Yep, Foresight. So there's no range bonus. Apologies, guys, again, for the dice cam not being up. One hit. Hit that evade. No. Broadside taking one. The next ship. Bullseye as well. 
Teal, Firing Foresight. Two dice gets the uh, free mod. Safe. All right. So Broadside taking a shield, and that is it. I'm going to step away one more time. RIP dice game. Absolutely, dude. I don't know what the deal is. Plug it in back in on both sides. Let's see if that did the trick. My new motherboard, so we should should be working. Cool. Now I just need to adjust the crop on it here. Betting is open, guys. If you were here with us at XVT yesterday, we had 10 hours of X-Wing. <laughs> oh, man, I'm still recovering from that. But it was fun overall. I had a good time. It was a blast. We did well. Um, lots of people were watching, chatting, having a good time. and Can't ask for anything more than that. First player is still Tyler. All right. Let's adjust the crop here. And then the right side. Okay, there we go. That should be good. That should do it. Dice cam is back up, guys. We're good. Whew, just one turn of shooting that it was down. That could have been worse. All right. So, sorry. They did the road roll, and now Sammy grabbed it. So, it is it is switched over. It only matters for the I-3s. So, Jag and Broadside. Turning in on Wolf here. Jag coming in on Vader. And he wants a lock. This is actually a little scary for Vader here because of where Oddball is as well. Broadside doesn't care about the Inquisitors. I think you check for Foresight here. You do. Foresight triggers. Spend that Force. No other mods. If you roll blank, that's just one. Plated Hull makes that a regular hit result. Turn down. Another damage into Broadside. One less. One shield left. Hit crit. Plated Hull. Makes it two hits. Taking it onto the hole now. Down to four hole. Man, foresight is pretty good. Now he finally gets a focus. Wolf, doing a one bank. I like that move as well. Try to get that back arc lined up for the extra dive. Get a range one rear arc shot. Taking a focus. And, ooh, I don't know if you have range for a target lock. He's going to check, and he does not. So he's just going to put it on Jag. Vader 4Ks. Vader's going to get shot three or four times here. Here we go. Don't know if you can kill... Is it range two? I don't know if you can kill Broadside this turn. Um, you would need a couple crits because of Plated Hull. Quizzers love these low agility force. Oh, dude, absolutely. It's, that's the dream, right? When they actually have, like, two or less greens. Hit crit, plated a hole. Spend it. Spend that force with his ability to force down. And takes only two. Tyler really needs half points, I think. is It's going to be hard. It's range three here from Oddball. Hoping for some luck with the Force. Just one. Spending the Force. That's not going to do anything. Vader rolls one. Wolf going to roll that extra die. Oh, he can't. His charge is is not... He hasn't spent it yet for a reroll. Because he didn't need to. Okay. 
Oh, I don't know. I think you still shoot into Vader here. You have to try to get token spend. Uh, I don't know if Broadside's going to have range 2. It was range 2 into, into him from Vader, so... Yeah. Two dice, two on three here. Oh, nothing. Yeah, doesn't look like Vader's taking any damage this turn. This was the turn I thought maybe he would do it. Now we're just going to kill Broadside. Uh, he pinged Foresight, but he spent his Force, so... Oh, you can change an eyeball result to a hit result. Your dice cannot be modified otherwise. Okay, so it's been a force for the bullseye trigger, but hit crit. Played it all, makes it two. I think Broadside's just going down this turn. Taking two more. Dies. Now you can start shooting into Wolf. Broadside will be able to shoot before he's removed. I'm going to close betting now. And there goes Wolf taking two. This might be a quick game, guys. Got range two innovator. Try to get a shield off. Spending the lock. Really need three here. All right, hit crit crit. Vader rolls pretty bad. That's a that's a shield. It's a good roll if, you, if you're uh, on the other side trying to get damage into Vader, rolling all those blanks. All right, trying to ionize them. Broadside special three. Will Vader be ionized? No, Vader rolls two. That is so unfortunate for Tyler. Man, so close, yet so far. Broadside removed. Vader one away from half, but trading an entire ship for just a few shields on Vader, is it worth it? A lot of people would say yes. Man, these blinds are not working very well. There we go. All right. It's a little bit better. Call them blinds because they blind me. That's what it is. There we go. All right. So I hope you guys had a good weekend so far. Um, we have some awesome prizes uh, to give away here today. Show you guys. Uh, we're doing 10, 20, 30 sub goals today, and we have our Anakin Adas from Drew, who's actually playing in our playoffs right now. You made these awesome, awesome cards. And then we have Thane Kyrell exclusive Paul Ruse. Just to show you guys what those look like. They're beautiful. And then we have Grogu Jumbo Force Tokens and Windy City Trials prize packs as well, if we get all the way up there. So we'll see what we can do today. Either way, it's going to be a lot of fun. I'm excited. So hopefully you've had a good weekend so far. And let's see if Vader takes half points this game, because even though he's one shield away, it's just like, it feels like it's slipping here. Can you spoil the next league art yet? Soon, soon. Uh, LV after LVO is when I'm planning on announcing it. Um, I don't want to spoil too much, but I know that I, I mentioned Merrick Steele. Um, la I think a couple streams ago, so that's a name to keep in mind. And yeah, that's as far as I'll go for now, but yeah. Yeah, snazzy, what's up, Daniel? Good morning. Here come the Inquisitors. It's the Inquisition. Wolf still hasn't used it. And that fits. Oh my god. And Foresight. Man, Foresight's really nailed uh, 
Tyler here. Two hits. Wolf taking two more. He's down to just two hull. I would imagine if Vader does a three bank, he's going to get clapped by a Jag, so. He's got to be careful about that. It's probably just 4Ks again, honestly. The next Foresight trigger. Hit crit. Rough. There's an evade. Crit goes through. You just hope it's not a blinded or a weapon tear. It's a direct. Oh no. I think he's dead. That He is dead. So Wolf is just removed. Ouch. Well, it's the arcs in a dream, baby. Just grabbing a lock on Vader just desperately here. Vader, three banks. He could barrel roll. He could evade barrel roll. But he's going to get shot by Oddball either way. He could, he could barrel roll the other way, but that, that could... I don't know, guys. gonna barrel roll yep that's gonna be range one from oddball i really really like i don't know range one in the vader here trying to get out of jag shot makes sense should be one less die for vader shouldn't have four greens Spending the lock on. I think don't know if he meant to re-roll that one. Three hits. Why is Vader rolling four dice right now? Is it obstructed or something? There we go. Vader taking only one. But that's half points. So 56.94. Tyler on the board with a lump sum. Jag has nothing. So now we're going to have our foresight shots again. I don't know if, bullseye, if we have bullseye on with teal, but we definitely have it oddball. And I think jag as well. Certainly jag. Yeah. Yeah, foresight has been huge uh, in this game. It's been just absolutely massive. So here we go. Making it too, getting the free mods. I'm curious how you guys feel about Foresight being able to just use it infinite times with free mods. I'm not sure they really, that really, um, I don't know about that. <laughs> to be honest, I think that's all I was saying. <laughs> Another shield, it's Jag. Alright, Jag is two shields down. But yeah, let's see. So, if, exclamation point league, if you guys want to see who else is playing in our 312 league, this is season five. Um, we've come a long way since we started, um, and we still have some of the same players. We have Max, who's been with us from the beginning. Um, we have some newer players, including Tyler, Michael, and Dan and Dave. Colfax has been with us for a long time. Joe Churchman, a former league champion, as well as Deslin. Neither of them able to make it. Deslin getting over. Uh, being sick, Joe had some obligations, but just want to give them both a shout out. Uh, Desi's actually in the chat. Just, just actually the last person that typed in the chat. You guys can see the bracket. Just go to rounds and hit that top eight. You'll see who's matched up. Colfax and Max are playing each other right now. We can pop in on their on their game, see how things are going. If this ends early, which we got 56 minutes and only two arc 170s left, so. But Vader is now just three hole. He's, he's still a menace. Probably doing another 4K. We're playing uh we're playing road, new obstacle rules, no bumping rules. Uh no tractoring onto obstacles, 75 minute timer, no round limit. That is what we're doing. And I just told him if, if it doesn't matter, um rolling the dice, you don't have to worry about it. You don't have to roll them. But so long as Jag is around, I'll keep doing it. Here is that roll. Sammy with the eyeball results.
holy holy shnikes yes holy shnikes indeed yeah it's been a very nasty game so far um vader has been halved but at a great cost man if jag does a three bank okay it is a two hard and that's going to trigger foresight again Jack's like, you gotta be kidding me! No range bonus. They're double blanks! Nice. Double blanksies. Gonna probably a bump here from Oddball as well. Well, you have a chance of hitting range one on one of these guys. Vader does does Vader things. Do you try to kill one of the Inquisitors? You just keep shooting into Vader, hoping to sink something in. Vader range two into Jag, three on one. Yeah, he has a he will have a kit fist at trigger. Yeah. Uh, did he forget it already? Like, is it too late? At the start of the engagement phase. Yep. So that was a missed trigger there, and I don't know what crit that was, but it looked like a panicked pilot. It is a wounded pilot. Wounded. So down to uh, five hole now. Damage engine. Oh, damage engine. Okay. Okay. Why did I think it was not a wounded or it was not? It was wounded. Uh, well, either way, I'm gonna fix it. Damage engine. Next up. Uh, I think he missed his... I think they're letting him do it at the start of the engagement phase. Uh, what are they saying in the chat? Nothing. Here we go. I think it's... I think Sammy maybe just shot right away and he didn't have a chance to do it. Spending the lock. One out of the dice box. Marksmanship, triple crits, and completely whiffs. That's a crit going through. What do we get? Ah, it doesn't matter. Fuel leak. Really wanted the direct. Just try to kill something. But alas. Here we go. Into oddball now. Teal is the is uh Teal is the one with the force up right now or force down. So pink here has a force. You're gonna spend it for three. Oddball has the evade. Doesn't even need to use it. So two shields down. Uh okay. So side arc here. Jack can check for a target lock. And it's just Jag's ability is you may acquire lock on the attacker. So he's going to do that. Into Jag now. And Jag not being able to turn really does sting here. Hit crit. Guaranteed crit going through. Hit crit. The crit is. Ooh, stabilizer. Ouch. Not fun here. 50 minutes left, and it's it's just an onslaught of damage cards here on the Republic side. Not a great matchup, I think we could all admit. But I did like that first round. If Oddball was able to get a little bit closer there, Wolf was just left out to dry just one turn too long. Fuel Leak would be more interesting if it... I, I agree. I think they're, like, is, is there... I don't know how you make it so that it's fair. But there are just like, like I'd say like 70, no, almost like the entire deck doesn't matter once a ship's down to one hole. Like console fire and direct hit are the two that come to mind that are like, oh, that ship could die or will die. But yeah, I'm not sure what you do about that. 
we had a conversation on XVT yesterday with Matt about the, the damage, the 2.0 damage deck. There were changes that we would make to it. But it's like he said, he put it interestingly. He's like, it's more punishing than the 1.0 deck, but it's also like less, it doesn't handicap you in the most, in the, in the most severe exaggerated ways that the original damage deck did, which is like blighted pilot used to just not let you shoot. That's pretty rough. Vader versus World 1 beyond the start one wasn't ideal. No, especially since it was range 2 as well, which Vader didn't mind just trading one range 2 shot. So yeah. We got top 4 and a final game after this. Three games of X-Wing today. If you guys are hunkered down, have yourself some coffee, some hot chocolates, some tea, or a, you grab yourself a beer if it's later in the day for you, or if you're just a day drinker or an alcoholic. And here's the road rule, eyeball, okay. So it is Sammy again. Yeah, no more wounded pilot removing your pilot ability. Ooh, gosh, I didn't even know that. That's rough, man. That is a very extreme. Oh god, foresight. So Jag bumps. If if Vader bumps here into oddball, he likes that, because then he just kills Jag. So I think the only hope is that he somehow didn't bump in the oddball. A 4K is easily blocked, I think. I don't think it fits between there. Uh, he's going to grab a lock, because Vader's probably not going to be in Bullseye anymore. Unless he bumps. He does block. Ooh, okay. I don't think that's range 1, though. Jag is down to 3, but he's going to get killed by Pink. Range two. Vader's super happy to bump. Yeah, they, one of the rare times when Vader just like loves the bump. Oh, that's not a full string though. It's only two. Let's see if you get that evade result. You get that natty evade. You don't get the natty evade. Taking two. Jag, pretty much guaranteed to die here. Living on one hole. Oddball is the healthier boy. Here you go, trying to get rid of... Sadly, you wish you could save Jag, but you just can't. Um, however, Jag will be able to shoot pink. Um, spend the force, make it three. Is that enough? It is. Just explodes. Alright. And Wilhelm screams. At the back, spending the lock. You have the lock here. Hit, hit, crit. And three evade, spending the evade. Oh, Jag. We loved you, Jag. You were so nice. You were so cool. Uh, are they setting dials right now? Is Pink not shot? Oh, Pink is facing the other way. Oh, smokes. I didn't see the firing arc. Jag's still alive. But he's got a loose stabilizer and he has one hole, so... I don't know. What do you do? You just one forward? Hi, Tommy. What's up, man? Welcome to the League Playoffs where Vader Defender is yet again a monster. Oddball getting that 4K lock on Vader. Ooh, I like that. It's not over, guys. It's not over at all. It is a close game right now. It's just, you just doesn't feel like you could do it because Vader exists. But So Tyler, now first player, matters for probably one more round. Just doing a one forward and fixing loose stabilizer. There's a Talon roll. You see it. And the 4K. Check that bullseye, Tyler. Let's do it. He's got that lock. 
into one bank from Vader. He can only evade. That's going to be a rage two shot. He's going to kill Jag here. But what if Vader dies? He's only on three hole, guys. Oh my god, this is exciting. Two. That's enough. Jag. Goes down. Range two shot into Vader. Let's go. Let's do it. Come on, Oddball. I believe in you. Vader has an evade. That's all he has. Oh, he's got to get. He's going to reroll both. He has the force, but he's spending the lock. There's three. Vader. Oh my god. You've got to be kidding me. He gets three evades. <laughs> oh no. Oh my god. Vader. I know, dude. That's just painful. You feel good about your chances when all he has is an evade. You're like, I could get a damage through. I could get one or two damage in. Cause if like if you landed like a loose stabilizer on him or something. He would have to do it too straight and just sit there. I think Oddball should just come in and wallop. Yep, just, oh, if a, a two or three forward here. Nice. Yep, just take the lock. Just wallop pink right here. Oh, no, Foresight. Boo! <laughs> Boo! Oh, man. And only one gets that free mod. Do you spend the force here? I don't think Vader's shooting at you. But also like he's gonna take he's gonna take one. He he really he really uh he wants to take the target lock, yep. Alright, shield's down. Vader gonna take a target lock. Here we go. Four on three here. Nice, there's four. A blank out, just just one shots. This Oh no, that's a good that's a that's a good roll. So he's gonna spend to not take half points. Man, you gotta acknowledge the green dice have been really, really good for Sammy. And that's where this list could really succeed is with just really good defensive luck, and he's gotten it. Uh and absolutely nothing. So had to spend the focus. So got a shield onto pink. Oh, the green dice, man. So it's a 41 point game. Vader has been halved. Pink is one away from half. It's it's still close. And you have some options with oddball, thanks to R4P. Um, ooh, I really want to see. Does he do a barrel roll? He just takes an evade. Nice! Very nice. Take a target. He doesn't even need to. I think you just take the focus. Invader 4Ks. Takes the evade. Will boost forward. I think he's got a shot range. 3 on to oddball. He does not. Nope. Here we go. Another opportunity here. Sammy just took an evade, but he has a force. Force evade. Pretty strong on the Inquisitors. Spend the focus. Hit hit crit. And there's the evade for 3 damn <laughs> he still has a lock though probably a 4k here or do we see another hard turn a 4k is gonna get him facing vader so three agility a three agility can be op as hell man this empire green dice absolutely yes rex for sure so so good 4k imagine vader does a three bank and boost evade boost the vader's greens were fairly average yeah um there was a turn i thought vader might take one extra damage didn't happen but that's that's back and forth right the inquisitors though yeah he's i think sammy's only rolled poorly one time with them um, that's all it takes though right he's got the target lock out there he's gonna spend it this is your chance actually to, to kill it only two four dice here and gets exactly what he needs. 
Inquisitor shot back. Range two, two on two. Or range three, rather. Uh, one last night. Okay, here we go. Spend it. This could go onto the shields. Oh, that's a crit onto the shield, on, under the hole, I mean. And it is a hole breach. Oh, boy. Not great, Bob. Not great at all. Hole breach on oddball. Vader staring down another three bank next turn. I'm just going to try to get in and try to one shot oddball. The pro thing is, if you don't one shot oddball, oddball could one shot you. Not likely because of a focus evade, but crit chain in there, only three hole. You get a crit in there, a nasty one, you get, an art, you get a direct hit, something like that, fuel leak, who knows? Urquhart said being a bit of a space potato. That's an interesting analogy for it. Uh, I played against this list a lot. It's not maneuverable, but it always seems to get to where it needs to go. Um, then again, I'm playing Luke and A-Wing, so it's it's certainly different than than Vader Defender. But Vader Defender is just a cheat code, honestly. You just you, it's yeah, that's probably sets up a block. Um, R four P's though. To clear the stress, Vader's are just gonna come in on the flank here. Unless he barrel rolls, I feel like it's tempting to do a barrel roll here. Oh. Sammy's licking his chops though. Three bank is just super nice. He's gonna take a lock. There it is. That's oh, so a three forward. It's gonna evade and boost. It should still get him that shot. It does. Yep. Here we go. Rage one. Vader, not great. Spending for hit, hit, crit. I mean, it could have been four. It wasn't. Hit, hit, crit. Oh, it's a hole breach, so panic pilot. Yeah, this game is over. The next one, it's, uh, blinded pilot. <laughs> oh, no! It is structural damage. He's not dead. Oh. Down to... Two hole with so many. Let me just make sure that's a blind. It's oh, it's a stud. Okay, it's not a blinded. Here's the range one rear arc shot. Spending the lock. Ugh, only two. Uh, one goes through. That's half points. One twenty two. One seventy one. Uh. Yep, clips him range one. This is probably gonna do it. Jag or Oddball has nothing now. No, uh, no defensive dice. That's two, and that is the game. GGs. GGs. My goodness, with 36 freaking minutes left. Holy smokes. Oh my goodness. All right, I'll just, just talk to him real quick. Exist, what are you guys doing to me? There's 36 minutes left in the game. What's your problem? What's wrong with both of you guys? I need to go to work soon. Yeah, but you still have to wait 36 minutes for everyone else to play to finish playing. So <laughs> this joke's Bro. on you, man. My God, that was um, <laughs> violence. I'm not. Yeah, I might have to put an age restriction warning on that game. <laughs> Yeah, and there's a reason why I still think Foresight is too cheap and these things should not exist like it does. Yeah, I, I, it's like turn. three mods like that, like it just, you just, yep. it, it's four points, right? It's really cheap. Uh, five. Five, yeah. Uh, yeah, I was talking about that earlier. I'm like, that just doesn't, it doesn't seem like it works as intended when you get to do that multiple times, but. It's the same as Snapshot. True, Snapshot, you just roll your dice so you can't mod it at all. Foresight's just better, right? It's just, just pound for pound better than Snapshot. Um, it is. Yeah, because the bullseye makes range. it so much better. Yeah. Oh, definitely. Um, yeah, man. Um, I was. I thought maybe when Vader was down here getting shot four times that he would, he would take more damage, but it just didn't work out, man. Um, it was close though. It's, it, I, I started to feel like Oddball could maybe find a way to get Vader because he had all his shields down. It's like you sink a couple crits in there. Who knows? No. Just one of those things. 
Yeah. Um, but yeah, good game. Um, both you guys, T Tyler, just one of those matchups, man. That's what it is. So. Yeah, it sucks. That direct hit. Um, it, like, the other stuff was whatever. That direct hit. That might put me out of X-Wing for a while. <laughs> that was so just, so tilting. But yeah. that's life. Well, I, ho I hope not, man, because I like I enjoy playing you. So you should maybe just yeah. maybe maybe it's Republic. <laughs> it's, I don't know how much of it is X-Wing. It's probably a compound of both Republic, <laughs> just being Republic. And um, but yeah, I mean, it's Vader is just so good when he gets his paint. And man, he was he was getting a lot of paint. So and then Inquisitors, too. I mean, you were able to kill one, but there was a couple turns where it could have taken some damage and yeah. just got the they are, needed. Yeah, they're really I call them mini defenders for a reason. You don't make damage if I don't fuck up the rolls. Yeah, they're it's a they're good company for Vader for sure. Foresight did a lot of work. On one agility ships, Foresight's just filthy too. Just like Yeah. Yeah, you just probably taking two damage, guaranteed, so Yeah, alright you yeah, guys. Yeah, the average well, is what one point seven or something like that. Yeah. Yeah. Well, um, Tyler, I don't know what your plans are, but if you want to do some commentary with me in the next game, let me know. You're happy yeah, to have you. Yeah, I'd be, so. I've got nothing to do. I'm down for that. Cool, for sure. All right, well, uh, let, let's take, uh, you guys take a break for a bit. We'll wait for the other players, and we'll see you guys back yeah. in the cantina. Yeah. Yep. Good luck, Sammy. Cool. All right. Thank you. Yeah, good luck on the next time. Yeah, have, have a good one. All right. All right, you guys. So... Oh boy, he may be tilted, but don't believe that he's quitting. He's just, he's quitting every time he dies. <laughs> no, I played him a lot. He he doesn't really, like, I think he's really good at internally hiding his tilt. Um, man, the sun is out. Um, but, no, 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 I'm, I don't think he's quitting. I was just like, he's like, that might be put, put me out of the game for a while. Like, I don't like when people say that, whether they're joking or not. But, I mean, honestly, that game wasn't, it, it felt more lopsided than it was. Um, truly because when somebody consistently rolls the way Sammy was on defense, you really just don't feel like there's a prayer because you're just expecting it over and over again to happen. Like, it's like, yeah, like here's three, two or three hits. It's like, it's, it's gotta get enough. It's not gonna matter. And that's, I think what tilts people is that they, they start to, they start to get, it gets on the, in their head that they're like, oh, that's, it's just like, it, whatever I do, it doesn't matter. And with Vader, it, sometimes that's the way it is. You know, if you're an I five, you're a, if you're a one agility ship, if you're whatever, he's he's moving last. So it's like whatever I do, just know it won't matter.